Welcome to part one of how to play ukulele. And in this video, we're going to be covering the parts of the ukulele, how to tune your ukulele, and how to strum it. If you haven't done so already, make sure you check out the introduction to this series so you know what we're covering. So, let's get straight into it. So this is my black Mahala ukulele, so let's cover the parts you may need to know at this stage. So this is the bridge where the strings, I guess you could say, are tied down. That's the sound hole. These are the different fretboards where you'll place your fingers to play different chords. And these are the tuning, just tuning heads or tuners or whatever you want to call them. So let's move on to tuning your ukulele. So going from the side closest to you to, I guess, the bottom, it goes G, C, E, and then A. So to make sure they're in tune, you can either pick up a tuner, which you can clip onto your ukulele or have, have near you, or you can actually these days pick up an app from the App Store that works pretty much just as well. So let's go ahead and tune our ukulele. Obviously in this case, in my app, when the bar goes green, that's when you know your ukulele is in tune. Obviously my ukulele wasn't really that out of tune, but when you make sure it's in tune, it just makes the song sound that much sweeter. So now, let's move on and learn how to strum our ukulele properly. So when strumming your ukulele, what you really want to be doing is having these fingers pointed in like this, and your index finger out. And loosely, but not too loose and not too stiff, pointing kind of towards yourself and then down. So you're doing this fluent motion. A great way to train yourself to strum properly is to be away from the ukulele and slowly come in, going up and down until you're actually hitting the ukulele. And strumming. What you might find is it might be easier at first for you to just be doing it a bit stiffer until you can master the fluent motion. For me, I actually started off just using my thumb for ages because I found that easier until I was able to easily strum the ukulele. So those are the basics to tuning and strumming your ukulele. So make sure you stick at that strumming motion because even if you can't do it first, it really does get easier. So that wraps up this video. Make sure you tune in and subscribe for next week's video where we look at chords and tabs for building a song. Thanks for watching.